you go first. Ooh, what's this? I think it's a magic wishing lamp. Hello? Genie? You in there? This is incredible. The entire history of the dragon race. It looks like it's all here. It is. Well, most of it. Did you hear that? It spoke to me! The records in this hall date back to the beginning of time. Nearly. The Chronicler! Yes, Spyro. It is I. And I've been waiting for you. Oh, well. I hope we didn't keep you waiting too long. We got a little held up back there with the, uh, well, you know. Riddles of Doom! It was a necessary evil. I had to be sure, Spyro. I haven't had any visitors in my solitude for over a thousand years. Shocker! Try getting rid of the psychedelic dragon outside! You've been here for that long? Oh, yes. But I have my books, and I watch and wait, and listen for things to come, and then add them to the books of time. You are also written in the books, though many pages are still left incomplete. I am? Can I see? Of course you can. This one is yours. Look. Seen this hideous creature before. Why is he in my book? It was Gaul who led the raid on the temple the night of your birth when Ignitus rescued your egg. And when they took cinders? Yes. That was most unfortunate. Oh, and look, here is little Sparks. Hey, hey, hey. nobody needs to see that. Ever. Wait, can these books tell the future? In parts, though. Just glimpses of the future, really. Then I want to know what will happen to Cinder. Spyro, you don't know. Please! I must know. <sighs> Very well. But hers is a darker tale. Spyro, you must understand when she was taken by Gaul, she was poisoned and corrupted, made to do the Dark Master's bidding. Her entire life has been spent in shadow. She knows no other way. And when the Dark Master returns, she will concede. No one can resist the temptation. Not even the strongest among us. I don't believe that. Spyro, let me tell you another story. Ooh, ooh, ooh! Can I pick the story this time? <laughs> there was once a dragon, long ago, whose raw power was far greater than anyone had ever seen or could imagine. At first, he mastered fire. Which was odd, because he was not a fire dragon. Then came ice and wind, and other abilities none thought possible. Is this story sounding familiar? It was a purple dragon, like me. The first purple dragon. In the beginning, he was encouraged, and secrets of elemental mastery were passed down to him willingly by the elders. But his power was limitless. It knew no boundary. He consumed everything. When he would not stop, he was cast into exile. And from his new fortress within the mountain, he built an armor, not of dragons, but of apes, and taught them to artificially harness the power of the gems, our life force. You're talking about the Dark Master? Yes. And in his dark seclusion, the sheer weight of his malice cracked the very foundation of the mountain, splitting the earth, creating a pit of despair where the lost souls of this world could reside. The Well of Souls. Created by the very beast who now seeks to escape it. But, but you said that the Eclipse would only allow the spirits to escape for a short while. Yes, but if there was ever a spirit powerful enough... Then how do we stop it? There is no stopping it. 
It has been written. Then why have you called us here? I don't understand. To ride out this storm, where you'll be safe. Live to fight another day. Well, that sounds pretty good. What about the others? What about their safety? I fear the worst for the others. And Cinder? Am I supposed to sit here and do nothing while she joins them? Uh, let me field this one. Yes! No. You keep talking about choosing a path. But what about Cinder? She was never given a choice. I have to try. I'm going, and you can't stop me. Then... I won't. Young dragon, I've waited far too long to watch you leave here stricken with grief and doubt. You'll need a clear mind and a pure heart if you are to withstand the evil that consumes that place. I know this is not the path you would choose for me, but I have to walk my own path and do what I know is right. So be it, Sparrow. I will show you the way, but you must hurry. The dark hour of the eclipse is near, and haste will be your only ally. All right, then. Well, uh, just so I know why I died, the plan is to wander into the land of darkness to face an army of evil creatures that will want to kill us so we can try to rescue another evil creature that has already tried to kill us? I'm pumped! Let's, let's do this. <laughs>